Now guys, today I'm going to share with you guys an example of a meditation it's called a spiritual protection meditation because all of us, we are spirit that resides in a body, but we think we are otherwise. We think we are the body. The body is just the vehicle. The spirit is eternal. And when your spirit, the eternal part of you is protected emotionally, mentally, physically, spiritually, then the body could go through so many iterations of life because life is like the ocean. There is ebb where everything, uh, where everything retracts and there is flow where everything comes back. So the body goes in states of ebb of flow with health, with weight, with uh, aging. And what we get to do is we get to work on the, the eternal part of the self. Don't get me wrong, guys, still exercise, still do uh, uh, your due diligence when it comes to types of food you put in your body, types of uh, anything you put in your body, including drugs. Be very aware what is it that you're putting in your body. But when we work on the eternal self, the spirit self, then guess what? The body aligns with that because the spirit vibrates at a higher vibration. Sadly, majority of people have forgot that there are spirit residing in a body and they feel like they are their belonging they're their possessions they're their jobs and if there's one thing that this pandemic is teaching us is that everything that we held so dearly to with our life like before no one would ever take a day off work because there was something important in their life they will just say oh i cannot take off i have a job this pandemic has forced not just the US, but nations across the globe to prioritize things. So let's look at it as a blessing as it's, it's showing us that there is a way. Now people are communicating via Zoom, people are working from home, it's shifting the paradigm that you have to be in location to work. So let's remember that we're spirits living in a body. And if we know that, then we get to cultivate our spiritual side. Right now I'm going through the Course of Miracle book. It's a book that I read long time ago and I didn't do it exactly as the author has said to do it, where you read a chapter a day and you meditate on it and until you feel like the chapter is complete, then you go to the next level. No, I just read it in like one big hit, one page after another. And I, I didn't just read it, I speed read it. It's like blasphemy. <laughs> <laughs> but I own it. That's what I did at the time. Long story short, now I'm going through A Course in Miracle and I'm doing exactly the way the book has been created. So what are some of the things that you could do to bring your energy up and to cultivate your spiritual side? And today, through this meditation that I'm doing with you guys, we're going to actually do a spiritual protection meditation. I'm going to share with you exactly how to do it. Hey, Christine. Hey, Bliss. Hey, uh, Marilyn, Marianne, hey, Liana, hey, Sonia, welcome, guys. I really appreciate you being here with me. So, guys, before we dive into the meditation, include the name of someone you want to send spiritual protection to. It could be a parent, it could be a child, it could be a spouse, it could be a friend, it could be a teacher. Uh, it doesn't matter who it is. Put your name, uh, sorry, not your name. You could put your name, you're on this live too but put the name of someone that you want to send love and protection to words. And then, so I'll give you a second to drop some names in here and then we'll dive in into the meditation. And uh, we're gonna have a, a really good time because it's a very powerful meditation. It's very simple, very easy. You can do it anywhere and you don't need to have the music that I will play for you guys. I just play the music to give you the ambiance of, of funness uh, and, um, but the reality of it is you don't need the music. You could be sitting in um, uh, in your office. You could be sitting in, at your home. You could be sitting outside in nature. You could be on a plane when you're taking a, a, a flight somewhere and just go into space and start to imagine yourself being spiritually protected. So are we ready? A lot of people are typing the names of their family and friends. Uh, thank you guys. Thank you, Francine. Thank you, Cecilia. Thank you, Liana, Christine, Marilyn, Edward. Thank you guys. I really appreciate you. Keep these names coming because this meditation is a living vibration space. So even though uh, uh, it's happening right here, right now at this specific moment in time, it has a vibration that 
transcends time. So whenever you feel like you could use extra protection, come back right here and do this protection meditation. Uh, and sometimes all you get to do, I'm going to also teach you the process of anchoring. Uh, so before we do the meditation, let me teach you anchoring. What is anchoring mean? Anchoring is, so this is the thumb and this is the index finger. You create a circle like this. That's called an anchor. So when you're going through good times and you feel so joyous and so happy, if you want to anchor the joy and the feeling of what you're experiencing into your body, you do this as an anchor. And I actually have so many different anchors. Uh, so I have this anchor for when I want to activate joy and abundance in my life. I have this as an anchor when I want to activate presence when I'm talking to other people. Uh, so you can create multiple anchors. You can do it, do it with this finger, with all the other fingers. You can create so many anchors. But right now, to keep things simple, uh, just know that the, the thumb and the index finger, if you put them together, then you created an anchor. And then down the road, when we do future meditations, I'll continue to bring the anchor to here. So you start to feel the emotion in your body and then you associate the anchor with the emotion and the feeling. And so when you're having a hard time, all you get to do is this and your body remembers like, oh, I remember when I felt so good on this meditation with Zane or on my walk uh, or when I spent time with my uh, pet. So when you do that, then the body start to feel the feeling of that emotion you felt and not the negativity you might be experiencing. So, all right, guys, without a further ado, uh, let's jump into the meditation. We have 85 people watching. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you. Please like, share and comment and uh, spread this to the world we want to bring enlightenment to as many people as possible and i need your help okay guys all right my loves let's dive into today's meditation be in a space where you won't be uh, disturbed for three to five minutes and just bring yourself uh, to the divine present moment and i'm going to start the music right now so be in a space where you won't be disturbed for a minute or for three to five minutes, maybe a bit longer, dependent, dependent on how long you want to stay with this meditation. So be in a space where you won't be disturbed for a, a period of time, dependent on what you like. Here on this meditation will be for three to five minutes. And start to breathe. Start to breathe in from the nose, out from the mouth. In through the nose and out through the mouth. And when you feel calm and relaxed and centered, look at the top, the tip of your nose through your eyes. Look at the tip of your nose. What you're doing is you're centering your focus onto the nose before you close your eyes. Many people, they immediately close their eyes. And that's okay too but when you center your focus onto the nose and then you close your eyes then you become i feel more grounded and more present in my meditation and then just continue to focus on the tip of your nose until you feel like you got it and then simply close your eyes now throughout this whole meditation guys i want you to continue breathing i want you to continue to breathe deeply through the nose and out through the mouth and just continue breathing. What you're doing is you're oxygenating the body, you're oxygenating your, your system and you're creating the vibration from the inside out. Now with your eyes closed, with your fully relaxed, present and continuously breathing, I want you to imagine, it doesn't matter if you were sitting down, if you were lying down, if you were standing up, it doesn't matter. I want you to just imagine a beautiful white light coming from the top of, the, of your head and pouring on top of you. Imagine like it is a shower head, a shower head that is on top of you, that is just showering you with a beautiful, beautiful white light. And imagine that beautiful white light is falling out onto your head and engulfing your entire body in a bubble of light. 
So it is surrounding you, that beautiful white light surrounding you. Imagine it coming on every inch of your body from the top of your head all the way down to your tippy toes. Imagine it covering your shoulders, covering your chest, covering your belly, covering your hips, covering your buttocks, covering your legs and arms and, and feet. Imagine it literally covering every fiber of your body. What we're doing right now is we're sending this beautiful white light. Imagine that light is coming from divinity. It's coming from your higher self. It's coming from God. It's coming from spirit. It's coming from Jesus. It's coming from Allah. It's coming from a source that brings peace to your heart. Whoever and whomever that source is, Imagine that source is showering you and bathing you with this beautiful white light. Now imagine this white light that is covering you from the top of your head all the way down to your toes is creating a shield, a beautiful vibrant shield that is shielding you. And this shield is not like any other shield you might have experienced because sometimes people when they hear the term shield they think it, they're going to block things away. This is a loving shield. This is a source shield. It's a shield that blocks you from negativity, from your circumstances, from people around you, from events, from diseases. It blocks their vibration from you. But it is open, wide open, to positive vibrations so when you're around people who are loving then that love goes through this this shield because it welcomes it it feeds on it this shield is coming from the white light and it's coming from divinity it's coming from god it's coming from spirit and divinity god spirit the universe whatever you want to call it is made of light it's made of love it's made of acceptance it's made of highest of highest of highest of vibrations so this is a shield that blocks lower vibrations and allow positive vibrations to come through and imagine that every time you experience a positive vibration that is coming towards you it could be self created like you felt good uh, you watched a, a funny video and you laughed and you felt good that shield is being fortified if you're in the presence of someone who makes you feel good, who sends you love, who sends you light, then it fortifies this shield. And just imagine this shield is literally covering you up and it's this beautiful aura all around you. Imagine this aura is happening around your body and it's extending 10 feet from every direction from every direction. So you become a globe of light. Everywhere you go, you are a globe of light. And that beautiful shield is extended 10 feet in front of you, behind you, on your sides, and 360 around you. You become a sphere of light. You become a sphere of light. And just when you feel that the vibration got so high, that your energy is so high, and the sphere is so huge, and it's vibrant and the energy of this sphere is just like it fills the world i want you to do the anchor that i showed you earlier before we dove into the meditation and i want you to anchor yourself in the presence of this beautiful vibrational meditation of this beautiful white light sphere the sphere of spiritual protection and I want you to really feel the feelings in your heart with the anchor, feel the feeling and then associate the feeling with the anchor. So down the road, when this meditation is over and you go back to your life, anytime you get to, you could use a little bit of a boost, just do the anchor and boost your energy. And before you know it, you will be continuously reminding yourself of the goodness that exists in your life. Now, guys, if you choose to continue with this meditation, by all means, pause this recording and just stay and enjoy this beautiful vibration of the sphere of light, of the sphere of light of spiritual protection, and just be present with it. 
and when you're ready come out of the meditation and for those who are here and they feel that they are ready i want you to continue to have the anchor and i want you to reinforce the anchor with the vibration of the following mantra i am spiritually protected i am spiritually protected i am spirit spiritually protected and then bring your attention back to your body one of the easiest way to bring attention back to your to the body is to rub your your hands like this or maybe give your shoulder a little bit of a massage if you do emotional freedom technique and tapping you can tap on the certain meridian points just bring your attention back to the body another way is put your hands on your heart and when you feel like you are present in the body then uh, get ready and open your eyes and bring yourself to the divine present moment congratulations guys you just did your first spiritual protection meditation and with the anchor that i taught you guys you have that energy within you for eternity every time i get to remind you every time you feel a little bit down you feel like life is getting the best out of you just do this anchor and breathe between the anchor and the breath you activate the vibration of that within you so all right guys let me pause the music thank you so much for being here with me today i truly appreciate you guys i love you so much you are a gift to me your presence in my life is a gift and i hope that my presence in yours is a gift so let's take the time that we have on our hands right now to fortify our energy to connect to our divine self to invest in ourselves and do things that brings us joy that elevates our consciousness that puts us in a state of vibration that is higher than the circumstances and the situations and the events that we live in because when we vibrate higher our subconscious mind start to release the old stories that kept us stuck and kept us hostage and start to let us live life through the eye of source or through the eye of the divine thank you so much for being here with me today i appreciate you guys remember if you need a little bit extra boost just come back to this meditation anytime you need it you know where to find it the recording will be on the page just come back, do the meditation, enjoy yourself, and always remember, spirit resides within you, and there is nothing the outside world can take from you if you continue to live from within. The outside world is a reflection of the inside. So if your outside world is not very positive, clean the inside, and before you know it, it starts to reflect the positivity on the outside too. Thank you so much for being here with me during this beautiful divine present moment. As always, remember to be present, be, be unstoppable, and be blessed. Till we speak again, may the rest of your life be the best of your life, and namaste.